Women are being warned not to put garlic in their private parts. Yeah, I've read about to this. To treat yeast infections. Do you know that Sal had some sort of, like, because he's uncircumcised, he had yeast in his pouch. Uh-huh. And uh, he put garlic on his penis and it and it got sore. I'm not making a joke. I mean, really? he really did it. Yeah. Like, I don't know where this garlic thing's coming from, but Sal is even putting garlic on his dick and he said it was really nasty. Uh, it couldn't get yeah. worse. Yeah, I mixed it with yogurt. It said to mix it with yogurt, and I chopped up the garlic, and I stuffed stuffed it in my pouch. And then the next morning I woke up, it was all red, it was sore, it was was out of control. But, like, why don't you just go to a doctor and have them treat these things? And I did eventually after that. I have uh, what's, it's called balanitis, which is like a male version of a yeast infection. I know what's weird about you is, like, what was that stuff you were taking um, recently? For, yeah, for my cholesterol, yet uh, red yeast rice. Yeah, he took red yeast rice <laughs> for his cholesterol. And then, of course, when he finally went to a doctor, his cholesterol level was even higher than it was supposed to be. Yeah, it was like doubled. Yeah, so, yeah, I eventually went to a doctor. So, yeah, don't stick garlic on. And I made the mistake. I, I was carrying this around in a canister. So I didn't realize, like, you needed to refrigerate the yogurt and the garlic. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, so when I put it on my penis, it was actually out for about eight or nine hours. Oh, my God. So I, I developed this new bacteria on my cock. But like, why, where do you learn these things that garlic should go on? You? Like, where do, where do you pick up this information? Right? You know what? I, I, just, I just Google all this stuff. And then, right. I, you know. But uh, Googling is not good. I mean, go to a doctor. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> Sal's cock is like a sandwich. You know when you go out on, in Manhattan on the street and you buy those, what are those? Gyro. Gyro. Yeah. Your, your cock's like a gyro sandwich. The ingredients of a gyro sandwich. You know, I once bought tea tree oil for my cock. Oh! <laughs> now that's got to burn. What type of oil? Like a motherfucker. I hit the roof. What type of oil? Tea tree oil. Yeah, and then, Robin, there's another oil I bought. And Why was, did you put that on your cock? For the same thing. I was experimenting with my balanitis. <laughs> I swear to God, Howard, I bought this oil. It was it was purple, and I just thought, okay, it's just the color of it. And my dick was like purple for a month. Like, <laughs> put this shit off. Like, why would you not go to a doctor? He'll right? try anything but a doctor. Why are people anti doctors all of a sudden? I'm really not. I just figured that you know I, I'm into homeopathic stuff. No, you're so. not. But you, at least go to a homeopath. You're doing it on your own. Yeah, you're trying to figure this stuff out, and you're not that smart. Thank you, Robin. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he's an idiot. And I don't mean that as a, a knock. Well, I, I, mean, a, I had a purple cock for a month. I guess you're right. Yeah. 